Welcome to week number five for Kate. My name is Jodie Bunting. This is our six-week course for our slimmers are going to lose a stone in six weeks. Hi, Kate. Hi. How are you doing? All right, thank you. What is the news from the scales this week? Another three. Oh. <laughs> wow, that is incredible. Yeah, I'm so you're, it, your total it, it weight loss. Out, if you don't eat chocolate all the time, <laughs> you lose weight. <laughs> your total weight loss now is 11 pounds. So we're actually on target, aren't we? We are. We are. So you've cut out the chocolate. Has that been the key? Yeah. Yeah, I think a bit. Well, just generally, just not snacking as much. Trying to make my meals a bit more um, substantial, and and instead, I think before I was taking calories from the meals to put into snacks. Yes. And now I'm trying to have decent meals and cut out the snacks. Perfect. You see what I mean? I would like yeah. to skip breakfast because I'd be like, oh, there's two hundred calories I can have <laughs> as a Kit Kat later on. <laughs> So again, long term, this is a great thing to do, you know, just to focus on healthy meals instead of just focusing yeah. too many on calories as well. So that is the good news. So well done. Uh, let's Thank have you. a little look through your food diary. So we had some uh, protein blueberry yogurt yesterday for breakfast. Yeah. How was that? It's nice. Yeah, it's uh, an Arla one. It's, yeah, it was, it was nice. I enjoyed it. And then for lunch yesterday it was a stir fry, egg noodles and uh, stir fried veg. Yeah, that it was a bit fun. of a random one, but basically it was stuff that we need. You needed to use up, I think, is what you were about to say. <laughs> we seem to have lost Kate. Let's see if she will come back through the connection sorry there we go i'm back <laughs> okay you were about to say yeah, you needed sorry. to use up those vegetables did you yeah yeah it was just stuff that we've got in the fridge that needed eating so it was just a quick lunch really it's a bit random but right saturday breakfast was a bacon and sausage muffin with a couple of croissants thrown in as well that was my mum. That was at her house. Oh, I thought you were going to say they needed using up as well. <laughs> no, that was my mum being a bad influence again. Wasn't she, Nanny, a bad influence? So the good news is it looks like you didn't have any lunch because of that, though. Yeah, yeah we did it as a brunch. That was the right. idea of it. And then it in the evening, brunch. you had some uh, chicken, some belly pork slices uh, with some salad, couscous. That looks nice. Yeah, she did like a mixed, like mixed salads. Um, so there was like a rice one and some. No, stop it. Well, go and do it downstairs then. Sorry. Yeah, it was very nice. It was lovely. I don't mind a bit of live harmonica. <laughs> <laughs> right. Sorry, my life. <laughs> <laughs> right, Friday, uh, bourbon biscuits for breakfast. Uh, for lunch was... Yeah. So I have to explain, I was at a conference on Friday, my first work conference that I've been to for years because of COVID and babies and things. Um, right. And when, when I got there, it was like coffee and biscuits. <laughs> um, but you can't do them well. Lunch, yeah, the weirdest lunch you've ever seen. So it was roast beef, turkey, roast potatoes, tuna mayonnaise, salad yeah. and a tomato. Very bizarre. Very bizarre. I couldn't work out what you were meant to make a meal out of, but anyway, it was fine. We, we managed. You've gone for high nutrients. That's the most important yeah. thing. And then in the evening, uh, a bit of pizza. With yeah. salad and tomatoes and then three ginger biscuits as well still came in for the day at 1500 calories which is bang on yeah yeah uh, thursday was uh the nutty granola for breakfast for yeah i'm not buying that again <laughs> why i love it it's really delicious and it keeps me full but it's so it's got so many calories in it i know it's horrendous it says, 
67 grams, 300 calories, and I bet I bet you don't get much for 67 grams, do you? No. So a portion on the box is 45 grams, and I was like, that's ridiculous. I'll give more than I'll give more to that than to the children. So I had to up it a little bit, but yeah, it's it's lovely. It's really nice, but God, it's so uh, so many calories, Louis. This is where you've got to love Rice Krispies because 300 calories worth yeah. of Rice Krispies is like a bucket full. <laughs> Yeah, loads. yeah, exactly. <laughs> right, yeah. lunch on Thursday was rivita with soft cheese and an apple. In the evening yeah. was um, mince with breadcrumbs, egg. Have you made your own? Oh, yeah, like meatballs. It was a um, like a tomato meatball pasta bake. Oh, yeah, with mozzarella. Fabulous. Yeah. Uh, nine squares of dairy milk. Yeah, sorry. No, it's okay. It's fine. You've worked here. <laughs> uh, the granola again on Wednesday uh, for lunch was a yeah. jacket potato with tuna. Yeah. And in the evening, some pork steaks with vegetables. Um, yeah. And just a little bit of chocolate again and an apple. And again, you stayed well within your calories on Wednesday. The last day, Tuesday, was a Skya raspberry yogurt for breakfast. Uh, for lunch, another salad, this time with ham and egg. Uh, and then in the evening, it was chilli and rice with cheese on. Yeah. Great. So I'm really happy with that week. Yeah, really good. The good I've news. have got to keep that, doing it now. <laughs> well, the good news is that you've, you know, you've still had some treats, which is the best thing, isn't it? Yeah. And you still managed to lose the three pounds. Now yeah, this no, week, I don't feel like I've really deprived myself. But now this week is a really uh, odd week because we've got two bank holidays midweek. Haven't we? Yeah. What's the plan to uh, get around this? I, I think just trying to make the rest of the time. I mean, I'm, we're not too bad because we've not got loads planned. But I think just trying to do as well as I can all the rest of the time um, and make lots of hopefully good choices when it comes to treats and things so that I get the maximum enjoyment and benefit out of them, <laughs> if yeah. you know what I mean. And I said to everybody, well, really, this is where it's good. Things I'm not bothered about. Yeah, this is where it's good just to focus on the calories a little bit and just, like you said, just have the things that you really want to spend your calories on. Yeah. Opposed to just having loads of stuff that you're not really going to enjoy. Yeah. I do try and think of them, and I don't know where I saw this, but somebody said try and think of it as money. Like, would you want to spend... If you've got, you know, 1,500 pounds to spend for the day, would you spend 300 pounds on that? And I was like, no. yeah, no, probably not. <laughs> you are very correct. I'm trying to will you be enjoying a lemon posset this weekend i mean it's possible my mum makes a very nice lemon posset so oh, it is she? possible mm, yeah really nice so yeah there is there is a high risk of lemon posset but i'll do my best but Usually, again, though, she puts it in tiny little teacups so you hardly get any so oh, does she? Right. oh great oh that <laughs> yeah. sounds perfect to me yeah yeah so you don't don't get loads so it's not usually too bad <laughs> fabulous right so what is your goal for next week finally i think i'm gonna say two because i think with the two bank holidays and all the stuff going on i think if i can do two that'll be that'll be good yeah that'll perfect. be uh, yeah that'll be okay i think wonderful i dare say three again i don't think i'll get that <laughs> <laughs> now what i'm doing with the others by the way have you heard of the 800 fast yes uh, i saw you post about it and yeah i have had a, i have not had a chance to have a proper look at the um at the menus but i have had a bit of a look so yeah we'll i'll give that a, a go it's basically it's what uh, Dr. Michael Mosley did on uh, TV a few years ago, where basically yeah. it's puttering the calories down to 800 calories, but obviously trying to make wise choices in those 800 calories, and it's not as hard as it may seem. Yeah. So if, for instance, yeah. you wanted a couple of days doing 800 calories this week, then that is another option as well, just yeah. to yeah. So you can have more calories maybe on the other days. Yeah. 
yeah no i'll give that a go definitely the, the menus look nice so i'll um i'll try it it's it's just fitting it in with like with the family because obviously they need enough calories so i've got to work out what yeah. i can how i can make the menu work for all of us but yeah. once i've done that it should be uh, yeah should be fine fabulous i right. give it a go so there's no dance yeah. fit on thursday so i will yeah. see you this time next week which will be the final weigh-in ah, i'm so excited wonderful right enjoy your week and what am i on what am i on do i need to do three though to get the stone you do need to do three because you're on 11 oh, pounds um, ah okay so I'll no try. pressure I'll try. but <laughs> i'll do my best this is the only thing i'm I thinking will try. this is why i just said you know if you could do like 800 for a couple of days it maybe will just yeah, give you that will, then. kick across the line that we yeah. need. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'll try that. Fab. Right. All right. Thank you, Kate. Have a good week and I'll speak to you next week. Okay. Yeah. And and you, Judy. Take care. Thank, Thank you. you. Bye. Bye. Bye.